should. <laughs> What's up? That's how we like to start it off. Yep. Start it off, set it off. Start it off with stupidity. Hello, we're live. We're live, Thomas. Tommy, we're live. Hello. Hello, Poppy. Uh, Hello, Poppy. There is one. There is a commercial break. Did you see that? That's pretty sweet. Yeah. 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 Anyway, good, good morning, everyone. <laughs> My name is Michelle Tantrum, and I am Tommy Tantrum. We are awesome people, very, very well known for our original you know, shows on Spreaker. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm just kidding. Just really the hooligans of pissing people off. They don't know who I am, but they know who Tommy is. The, the world famous rapper. Uh. <laughs> anyway, welcome to our show. Hopefully you have fun kicking back and listening to our, our, our greatness. I will be singing today and Tommy will be doing narrating, right Tommy? So, <laughs> it was one man. Oh, one man came I was kidding, in Tommy. his pants. Okay, why don't you stick to rapping, babe? <laughs> <laughs> Why would I can have that sick ass movie voice? One man, one dick, his butt. Tommy's not allowed to lean towards camera anymore. Why is it? <laughs> <laughs> because he thinks all of a sudden he is a movie star. <laughs> one Tommy tantrum. Anyway, back to <laughs> back to what I was saying. I will be not singing. I was just kidding. <laughs> Really? Do we have a bird here now? Fucking pterodactyl. Uh, Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna get any serious news in with you here today, huh? I shouldn't have ate that chili yesterday. Mmm. That's, that's a good thing to say to your girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> that's where the pterodactyl came from. Chili? Yeah. Pterodactyl. How does pterodactyls come back? Pterodactyl. Oh my god. You see, you're, the, you're lucky you're good looking. <laughs> You're not, mm -hmm. you're not the smartest sometimes, Dave. <laughs> oh, he's good looking now. I'll, I'll vouch for that. Yeah, uh, I do. So, uh, I can rub your leg and nobody can see. Oh. Yeah, so, <laughs> you know, the great thing about uh, doing a show Spreaker is you can be sitting there fucking chilling, chilling in your boxers, you know. Good morning. You are your boxers. I didn't notice that. He's wearing okay. He's wearing boxers, which I think are a little big on him. And then he's got his his uh what what's this called the jersey? Uh, is it hostility? Yeah. His hostility jersey. So he looks cool from the top up. But oh, he looks cool from the top up. But from the you know from down the waist, he looks like. You know, he, he's just some normal guy sitting around in his house watching TV. Well, the fucking tourist. But the funny thing is, is look at me. Tourist up the living room. Look at me, though. I, uh, oh, I don't look very good. I haven't brushed my hair yet. I haven't brushed my teeth. No makeup on. My boobs look good, but... What are you getting at? I was trying to fish for a compliment. I see that uh, I can basically look like crap when we're on just uh, doing this type, like on, on the air, instead right. of being on video. And right. I was describing what, you know, what... what kind of reminds me? But you were supposed to say, no, you look beautiful, Michelle. Oh. Well, see, how's that you just try to surprise me with some kind of <laughs> hidden, hidden window? It's been two years. He should know when to compliment me. Every day. <laughs> smoking the Buddha. <laughs> oh, it's God. Uh, so, sp speaking of smoking the Buddha, uh, have you and One Mind, you know, thought of do bringing back Smoking Society for a, you know, a concert, a reunion concert? Yeah, uh, you know, we've discussed it a couple times. Um, How does he feel about that? Um, I think we're still at a standstill. He's, uh, you know, we're obviously in different areas, right. different regions. We're in world. Colorado, and he's still in California. Yes. Right. Um, but I'd very much like to bring that back. So. Yeah. You know, I mean, the societies of the shit. It's a classic. It's where it all began. Um, for all of you who, uh, you know, haven't aren't familiar with Tommy Tantrum's 
early beginnings. We all know you know who he is now, but uh, back back in the day, he he was uh, smoking society, and or he was part of it. I still am. Yeah, uh, yeah. I guess once smoking society, you're always smoking society. Yes, yes. Yeah. Um, actually, um, we're going to be coming out with uh, some new tracks, uh, Me and One Mind. Are you? We're going to be doing some collaborations. Oh, also, uh, nice. I've, uh, We've got a lot of collaborations been, coming up then. Yes, yeah, so I've actually been doing some producing for this uh, MC out in Colorado named oh, yeah. Little Chunks. Yeah, he's great. He, yeah. he is great. Wait till you guys, you know, we'll have to have him on one day. This dude can, this dude can spit, he can, man. He can spit. He sounds a lot like, uh, is it Johnny Richter I think he sounds like? Or, or a duo. Uh, with, his own, with his own individuality, though. He's a little more gangster. He's yeah. A little more hardcore. Yeah. Um, so, y'all can be looking for his new track coming out soon. Little chunks. And they can always find, you know, information on your sites, you know, right? At, you know, yes. Yes. Yeah, so in fact, um, TonyTantrum.com will be up soon. Will it? Yes. Uh, until then, we'll we we show Tantrum.com up, right? You know what? I, I, I would like to. I right, would definitely right. like to. And then I could just promote, you know, all the girlfriends of the rappers on right. my site. Right. Know. All the you know the girls that really see, have. See, so you're trying to do. You're trying to do an MC live, MC lives. I'm trying to ride on your coattails, babe. Uh, you know, you've got the talent, musical talent, and so my talent will be, you know, saying I'm your girlfriend. That's that thing. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm the good looking one. I guess I do have a lot of talent. Yeah, it actually does. Why is it always the rappers that are the ugly ones? Uh, it's because they have ugly personalities. <laughs> oh. Just not ugly. Again. Not ugly. You're gorgeous. He is gorgeous. Yeah, hell. Yeah, it's true. So, so what? Oh, what? Oh, did you want to play that or something? I don't know. Or uh, you know? Oh, I still. Cool? I guess we, we can release to? that new revolution track that I did about right two months ago. Well, do you want to do like a big build up for it? Is this a the new release? I mean, you're releasing releasing it? No, no, that would be uh, actually my single, Whispers, it's going to be coming uh, out. And that was kind of an actually interesting topic. Um, I, you know, it's the shooting that went on at that elementary school. Oh, that's um, memorable. That's when, remember, that's when I had wrote it. I wrote true. it right after that. Oh, I didn't so, know that. You told yes. me. I thought you wrote it about, you know, for some reason I thought you wrote it about death and your family. Something your family? No, no, no. Oh. No, no. Um, whispers is God, basically... I don't listen to you do. I'm so sorry, babe. Tell me. I'm interested, though. Whispers is basically a track that I wrote. Um, it basically describes, you know, humankind right now in today's day and age. Right. And basically, I mean... If you're going to schools and you're shooting little kids, you've got problems, yeah. you know? Yeah. Um, and that's not just, that's not just a mental health issue. That society. can also be a society uh, issue as well. Yeah, that's true. You know? Well, it's um, another level, you know? It's, it's, it's yeah. completely crossed over anything I've ever you know, grew up with and right. had to deal with. It's just escalating what's going to be next. Yes. Know? Yeah, I agree. Now this uh, track whispers, uh, I kind of, you know, threw a little popish, you mm -hmm. know? Yeah. Sort yeah. Of, you know, I felt like doing a little Michael Jackson dance, you know what I mean? Is that what you were doing when you recorded it? <laughs> no. But that was, a, that was an awesome track to record it. I mean, it you did it very fast. You know, you, you, you got in there and you must have already had what you wanted in mind. You know, came together yes. really quickly and, and flowed really quickly. Well, yes, and I, and I had uh, produced that, that beat as well. And yeah, when, I heard that, when I heard that happen to those little kids, I was like, man, I need to do a song. Mm -hmm. So wow. that's what I did. That's awesome. So It, it makes me think even more about it you know i really like it i like the song 
it's very catchy. After one time listening to it, you know, I was I was sitting right. along with it, and I love songs like that. Not because you're my boyfriend, but because you have talent, musical talent, and it shows. So. Well, what I'm what I'm thinking of doing is I'm gonna probably uh, remix that song as well. Oh yeah. I want to remix that track as well and get some get some other MCs on it. Yeah. Um, I've been speaking with one mind in regards to that. What about Dead Serious? You know, are you thinking about bringing Dead Serious onto this album? I don't know. <laughs> she gets a little too bossy. <laughs> <laughs> and she thinks that she tries. She tries, she tries to sign my paychecks. Uh, so. What do you mean? You sign your paychecks to her. Ah, yeah. Ah. That's right. That's right. If anybody doesn't know, that was my what I would call myself. I would say that I would, that I I'm going to be a, a rapper, name myself Dead Serious, and um, it, it's been an ongoing joke with me and Tommy, you know, because obviously, yeah. <laughs> obviously, uh, I'm not going to to do that. But right, I like to scare him into thinking yeah. that I would. Yep. So, um. Well, well, where'd it go? Should we play the uh, yeah. revolution track? Sure. All right. Let's do it. All right. All right. We'll be back in a few, guys. Here's revolution, and hope you enjoy it. Industry ready production. PSBeats.com. Make your purchase now. Down on my generation, down with no word, but it looking, looking, never find hope. This revolution is the end of confusion. I'm the illusion of all this evolution. I'm at the top of all revolution. No time to confuse them. The enemy I'm choosing. When we lose them, we gotta stay with twos in case we lose it. Stay with the whole crew. Oh, dude, I'm a smoke society like the whole crew. Bob's girl. What's up? Oh, I was getting a little sidetracked there. Yeah. Sorry about, sorry about that. I'm gonna turn that down a little bit, right? Um. Yeah. You just you just gotta mute that. Oh. We got a new. She's learning how to DJ, folks. <laughs> she's learning how to DJ. This is a DJ. This is this is producing. Oh. Oh. It's not only hosting. Oh. Kind of hosting. Oh, look at that. Go on. Wait, wait, wait. It's 
sour. Oh, it's me. <laughs> That's really sad when I get excited because there's so many chatting, but it's me saying hi. Right. Uh, not only do I, you know, think I'm the main co-host, but I also <laughs> think I'm producing. Sometimes I think I'm actually, you know, responsible for your singing. And I... <laughs> oh, wow. Shame, well, but the ain't, ain't that just is like that. a woman, you yeah. know? They try to take credit for every everything that you do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. That's what I try to take credit for everything good that she does, so. Oh, because you a, a lot of sponsors. It's a mutual Wait. respect. Mm -hmm. Without him, you know, I don't know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> There's some bubbles, you would, you big smoker. Smoking the bomb bubble. You would, you would say that. Here, you know what I'm going to do? Bomb bubble. This is going to be Tommy pretty soon. He's going to be rolling. I'm rolling. He's going to be rolling up shit creek. There we go. All right. Uh, that's a messy roll. There it go. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you, well, you know, there. All right, you need to back off here, buddy boy. Why are the aliens speaking to me again? Did you just call me an alien? No. <laughs> just kidding. Dang. <laughs> you know, I'm this, just kidding. This is better than being in black. Straight up. Being in black. Can't see the fingers. I didn't know that part. Oh. You always have to do me. What are you talking about? I just finished your, your, your verse. <laughs> I know. I'm kind of hating on you today. Yeah. You know why? Why? You know why? It's, I think it's because, uh, I don't know. I think it's because I am jealous of your, your musical abilities coming out. You know, I I think that I should have them and that you should you should be the one that you know, cheers me on because you're so good at that. And I'm more right. like the greedier one, huh? Where it's like, it's all, you know me? Yeah, yeah. <gasps> I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> what a douche. I am not jealous of anything. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. He's such a douche. No, no. I, I'm not. I'm, I'm actually so proud of him. Well, you know, you actually sound like you're doing good. Well, I was trying to get Michelle to sing with me. Oh, yeah. 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 And, uh, but I bossed that too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I try to be such a control freak. <laughs> yes, yeah. I do. I, I boss. I boss him. Then I get all frustrated because I just want to get, get in there, sing something right away, one time on the mic, and then you upload it to something right away. I'm so impatient. I have no, you know, I, I have no concept of the actual way you do a song. You know. Well, the right way. When it comes to... I just karaoke it. I mean, when it comes <laughs> to producing a good track, I mean... Yeah. From from that hook that you were singing that day, I mean, I it sounded really it. good. I don't remember it. it. I don't remember it either. I mean, that... I, I know. I just remember it sounded really good, oh, you know? thank you. So... Yeah. Instead, I decided to just, you know, sing along to other, other artists and put it on YouTube and then regret it when I sobered up, you know, yeah. and I'd be like, why did I do that? You know, you should never drink and record something and put it on YouTube. Because then what happens is, you know, the next day, why? the next day you, you look on it and you're, you you think, oh my God, that's so embarrassing, right? That's and then awesome. you decide, okay, I'm going to take take it down because I'm yeah. seeing Cindy Lauper, you know, out of key on, on YouTube. So then I, I want to take it down, right? But by that time, I've already forgotten the password, so I can't even get in there. And then I start another account. So then I have like five Twitter or uh, YouTube accounts, <laughs> all with really bad videos all around them. Yeah. Uh, you know, you should have to have an app where before you upload something, you should have to take a breathalyzer. That would suck. Yeah. <laughs> no. It would. It would suck because there wouldn't be that many videos and stuff out there. But. You know, it would really help with the people who, who uh, get drunk like me or drink a little like me, and then they think that they're a performer like you. You know, I think I'm on, like in concert on stage. In reality, I'm in my you know <laughs> room. There you are. I'm in my bedroom. There you are. <laughs> thinking I'm doing 
Bob diggity dog. Uh, good times. Good times. Would you like me to see some single offer? <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm kidding. Oh, I'm kidding. I won't do that anymore. Mm. Not, today. not today. Cindy okay. Lauper. She, you know, Cindy Lauper, though, you have to, I'm from, I'm old school, so the 80s, that was my, my time. Madonna, right. Cindy Lauper, you know, Pat Benatar. Well, yeah. Those, those were like the, the founding women of, of that time, you know? Right. So that, that's big. Well, I mean, yeah. I mean, they, you have to give it up for a lot of the artists in the past. I mean, yeah. that's where our music originated from. They basically shat out a golden age for us. Did you say shat out? Shat. Like shit. shat. Like shit. Oh, okay. Shit a golden egg. That's a really weird way of putting it. I would have said shit, you know, they... But could you imagine, could you imagine Madonna trying to shit a golden egg such as this? I think that maybe if she did that, she would be such, you know, she has such a, it's like she has a stick up her butt anyway, you know? Maybe oh. she would be more laid back and not so uptight. She's so <laughs> tight. You know, she's like, she's always working out. She's always, you know, she's just such a, oh. What are those women that you, you think, my God, you know, settle down. <sighs> you don't need to be Miss I thought you liked her. I do. I really like her. But I think she would do maybe a little better if she, I don't know, maybe relaxed a tiny bit and yeah. wasn't, I don't know. She just seems very overbearing. Right. You know, I like strong women, but I, I don't like ones that scare the shit out of every man in the world. <laughs> Right, right. Uh, I, I don't know, I just like it. I still like, we were talking about this last night, too. Um, flock of Seagulls. I could... <laughs> when I ran. I ran to the following. You know, the funny thing with that is that, did you, did you ever see the video? Because I know you were, what, probably just a baby when that came out. But... All of them sat, I mean, the video was hilarious, but they had the, all their hair sticking, their bangs sticking straight oh, up. Oh, I didn't see that. Straight, straight up, just like that. I see yeah. what, I see what. Like or something. Yeah. But that was the, that was the style. You yeah. Know? There was a lot of bands. I was thinking that. about remixing, um, on a flock of seagulls beat. Which one? I only know that the one. The I ran. Yeah. No. <laughs> you it's like the only. I don't think that's been redone really or, or, or done, you know, any differently, has it? You know, I don't know. That would actually be pretty pretty good. Pretty, yeah. pretty interesting. Yeah, to put your own twist on it. Well, you know, I was remember when I was doing that remix of uh, Tom Petty. Oh God. Oh man. Really, really want to do this one. Yeah. That was very not not my computer shut down. No, that was when we were we were having an argument, and I was like, I'm gonna break it up with you, and because we were just arguing, this a long time ago. Sure enough, he starts. He starts doing, you know, his song, and, and what was it you kept singing loudly over and over again? Oh, I wasn't singing it. Mr. Petty was. <laughs> what was it, though? Because I'm free, <laughs> free falling. Yeah, so I was all upset and sad. I was like, oh, and she I'm kept hearing the free and all I heard was over and over. Free. <laughs> over and over again. I was like, why? That's why. Yeah, I was <laughs> pathetic. That was that was a while ago, babe. <laughs> now, it's not like that now. Right. No. I would kick your butt. <laughs> <laughs> Do you hear my chair squeak? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. that can be heard. Me, 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 me. What the heck are you doing? What? Me, 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 me. I have come from outer space. I thought that was funny. No, I was just waiting for that oh. time. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what? To do what? Yeah. Really going with that way. I've come from outer space to shit a golden egg. <sighs> That's, you are really, really making me happy in my man today. <laughs> you sitting here in the boxers talking about shitting up golden eggs. Right. What a, what a hunk, of, hunk of bunny love. Hunk of, hunk of bunny love. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> did you really do that? <laughs> uh, well, how did you do that when I did a look? See, this is why I like to take control of the board, the soundboard, because oh my, like, you just made a cow. Yeah. Wow. Oops. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> You're a jerk. Okay, I'm gonna go. You're a jerk. Oh, whoops, my bad. You're a jerk. You're a jerk. So, what is new on the news? I don't know. I, think I, I could give a shit less. I, I don't know. I was thinking maybe. Oh, you know what? What about Lil Wayne? You haven't even talked about that. Oh. Uh, Has anybody heard anything more about that? Um, you know, that's. I don't know. I'm surprised you have not been all up and, you know, finding out what's going on with that. Let's look on Google. I don't know if anybody else, you know, is interested, but that's a huge Well, I've seen, huge I've seen people having yeah. Facebook statuses really? and shit basically stating, anything. you know, that they're, it's, it's kind of oh, sad that stating maybe? that they're, uh, they're stoked that he's going to die or something. That's where you saw the negative stuff on Yeah, that's, yeah. That's sad. Yeah. You know, I'm, I I like Lil Wayne okay. You know, I, I like some of his music. Yeah. Um, I, I'm not a huge Lil Wayne fan. I think he's a little overrated. Sorry, I do. And, but I, I don't want to see him die. I mean, I don't want to yeah. see him struggle or, or, you know, go through that. Yeah. You know, but maybe, maybe that there's just a lot of people out there that are haters. Yeah. Oh, that's the name of, that's the name of this episode today. And oh, haters. It's all about haters. Haters, no. And the, the thing is, is that it's not about, like, me hating, you know, anyone else or you hating anyone else. It's about everyone hating us. You know who I hate? <laughs> who? I hate Mormons. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, actually, I got a lot of Mormon friends. I just give them all shit. I was going to say, because you can marry multiple women. You know, they can marry multiple that's, women. No, that's that's not true. But I know, but I was kidding. It, you can in some it, Mormon. You know what? I found it funny how they did a show, The Sister Wives or whatever. I liked that show. But, yeah. I, but I mean, you know, everybody was talking about, like, how how cool and how lucky they would be to be able to do that, you know what I mean? Uh, but I mean, seriously, uh, would you really want to be married to all three of those women? Or is it four? How many was it? Uh, there was a lot, four, I believe. They're, they're nasty. So, my, my, <laughs> my, opinion, yeah, my opinion is, my God, can you imagine having more, more of me around? Like, one, one wife or one girlfriend and stuff has got to be enough. Yeah. When you see that guy just running all over the There's no place. way he can satisfy all those girls. Yeah. There's just no way. I guess he goes from one bedroom to the next, like, different nights, you know? Oh, I thought you were saying, like, all in a row. I was like... Oh, no, 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 no. no. Damn, no. this dude... No. He's lining up all his ducks in a row. That the case a lot more people would be coming more in. Like, <laughs> all right. Yeah. I have to change their mind on that one, huh? No, um... Well, yeah, I went to the Mormon church once, and I thought it was going to be a big orgy. Did you really? Yeah. Did you, did you show up at, like, dressed, dressed to party? No, they were wearing weird sandals. No, did you, like, show up in, you know, like a, you know, Playboy robe, and, like, oh, yeah. No. You're from, from a sex party, where you at, girl? No. What'd you, what'd you wear when you went there? Well, I thought it was going to be an orgy with a bunch of men. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. That's nice. Nobody gets my sense of humor. Uh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, that's why he's my boyfriend. He's all, you know, he'll say things that even shock me. <laughs> all right, I'm taking that this away. So, it's not true. Christopher Columbus did not discover America. He did not. What, where did you hear that from? That's crazy. I discovered America. Oh, you know what? I, I discovered I America. Think, I think that's what you were daydreaming about, or, you know, dreaming about the other night. You were rattling yeah. off. Yeah, you are rattling, rattling stuff off. You are like, uh, it's me. I'm the one. I'm the one. I'm number one. You know, and then I... Number one? Number one. Like, it's me. You oh, were you racing? I don't know, because I was thinking, cool. I know you're not bragging about your bedtime skills. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm feisty in the morning. Yeah, I even discuss myself with my bitch name. So So why I don't know what I'm doing. That's why we're on the show. 
because we don't know what we're doing. Yo. And nobody will ever know. Fuck, fuck, fuck. They will think we can't We need to do Get, get, get. Shout. Yeah, Whoa, what the hell was that? I don't know. That was, that was pretty cool, though. I think some kind of weird sense, so. though. Oh, it did? Yeah, it was all beep, beep. That was probably my voice. <laughs> That's when it's not out of tune. Whoop! <laughs> oh, what's up with the <laughs> uh, I think, you know, it's been 30 minutes. I think uh, it's time for us to bow out for a little bit because in a little bit, I have a huge surprise for you. What huge. is it? Um, we're going to be not only you talking on here, but we're going to be getting one mind to call in. One mind? Yeah, he doesn't know it yet, but one mind. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe someone of the same caliber uh, to call in and... Calibre. Calibre. Yep. And that's, then we'll have somebody to share it with, you know? Share all your... Hooting and hollering? I'll be doing hooting and hollering. Well, these kids the other day that came around my house, and I, I could have sworn that motherfucker decided to, uh, you know, what? What? You what? What? see I, them boys the other day? It's getting way better. It's like you sat down somewhere out there in the farm, and somebody told you how to real accent. You said, yeah. hey now, I was born, I was born by these, by these balls in the barn. Of, of the bowls. Well, I was born when my daddy was decided to fucking go. <laughs> I ain't on half goat. Is that? <laughs> you have to make goat sound. You're half goat. Huh? <laughs> Actually, I have heard you. <laughs> I have heard you make sounds like that. Huh? Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> Give me some paper. Wow. That <laughs> 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 so this one time when I was a kid, right, we, mm -hmm. we went down to Knott's Berry Farm, and I had the map. We were just talking about it. I was looking, I had the map in my hand, and... Of course you did. This, yeah. this goat, this motherfucking goat, man, I see, fucking goat. I see him just running around. In Knott's Berry Farm? Yeah, he's running around. Oh, were you at like, the petting area of it? Because they were no. running around in Knott's Berry Farm? No, no, no. Were you in Knott's Berry Farm, or were you at the park across the street with... Cause they, they have, they have Knott's Berry Farm. Oh, that was that Hobo. Oh, yeah, Hobo the goat. <laughs> ah, yeah, dude. Wow. I, I forgot he still owes me 30 cents. No, okay. That is really, I think that you have <laughs> some, uh, some serious flashbacks from your childhood. I don't yeah. know what, what was going on with that. Of course, All the memories sound like serious acid trips from mm -hmm. high school. You know, it's kind of weird. Probably from all the, maybe the cough syrup, or fucking, I don't know. But that you, that you were given to calm you down as a child? No, no. Oh. That well, uh, that I decided to partake recreationally. You know, I did, uh, I did stupid stuff like that when I was a little younger. To, you know, the seasickness stuff, Dramamine or something like that. Decided to drink a whole bunch of it. And bad. Uh, it was really bad. Bad. I, <laughs> <laughs> I was chasing a chicken down my street and uh, trying to jump, jump mm -hmm. off the... There was a chicken. You were trying to choke the chicken? Was beach. I was trying to choke that chicken. First I was trying to catch the chicken. I was probably chasing the poor Mexican guy that lives across the street. <laughs> yeah, I was like, come here, come here, come here. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I feel very bad for that, but, you know. You That's like a punk rock. Yeah. Are we going to do this again? Who's more punk rock? Mm -hmm. Okay. You Folks, you heard it. You heard it. Basically, we are going to what? we are going to see who is more punk rock throughout the day. Okay? Ooh, we are going to do a, a fucking competition. A poll. A competition. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Michelle Tantrum is in the building. Vote for me. You weren't supposed to do that. Yeah, I, I was, I was, was being punk rock. <laughs> that punk rock thing's actually just taking That wasn't it. punk rock. That punk rock would have been like, like this. You know what I mean? I swear it wasn't even about the fucking. That is not uh, punk rock. 
Yeah, fucking no. quoting Keith Morris, dude. Uh, when you quote people, that, that's not punk rock. You want to be an individual. You do the, you don't follow people. You you do the, your own, you know. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty punk rock. Yeah. <laughs> you, know, you know what I always thought was punk rock? What? Is taking a shit in the toilet, grabbing the Ziploc bag and throwing it on a brand new car with the dude standing there looking at it. Uh, that you you say these things like you know what's punk rock blah blah blah, and they're they're all like funky things like that. That just sounds like more of like a not a punk rock thing, but more of like a dumb teenage idiot kid thing that like means you're more of a rebel you know a rebel bratty kid you know what the kid? fuck are you talking punk about rock. punk rock was punk rebellion rock. punk yeah. rock was a scene punk rock was fucking anarchy no punk rock was basically saying you know Tell what, me what i don't is. give a fuck about anything i am who i am and people don't like it they can kiss my ass and it's all about non being not, you know not being like everyone else. That's how it was for me when it was originated back when I was younger. Back in the, you know, 80s. It was, it was fully formed, you know? Right. I formed, helped form punk rock. Do you swallow your eyes? Yeah. I helped form it, and so therefore I, I, I was... Feel, I feel very offended. I had, I had a mohawk. I had a mohawk before you even conceived in your mom's belly. You know what? <laughs> Before I was conceived in my mom's belly, I was still up with Jesus, smoking the jaber. You were smoking. You were smoking pot with Jesus. I don't know. That's that is pretty crazy. No wonder you think you're punk rock. Yeah. <laughs> that that's just crazy. You know what's even crazier is that I just said that I had a mohawk before we were even born. That that kind of makes me, you know, look like an old punk rock person. No. <laughs> no. uh, so, so you I guess the original punk rock thing, or not the old, but the original? No. Oh, I thought you fall for it. No. Okay, whatever. Uh, we'll just find Such out. Such a useless generation. That was pretty sick. That was pretty good. One man insulting your useless generation. Oh, wow. One shit. Okay. One piece of paper. Wow. You seriously are just entertaining. Oh. <laughs> I did that. What now? What now? My voicemail. <laughs> I did that the other day. I had my phone in my, you know, I was putting my bra right here. And right. I, you know, it was like, I heard my boot saying something. It was like, <laughs> I was like, yeah. wow. You know, I'm really, really. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but they've gotten so big now that they talk, you know. Oh. So, so I looked down, I'm like, oh my god, Barry, I'm going to pull it out. Pull, I pull out my phone, I mean. Oh. I, I, <laughs> for my bra. You pull out some titty. No, I didn't do that. Not not at that time. But I pull my phone out and show up it, it's gone somewhat. I oh. hung up. Yeah, I was like, oh my goodness, I'm so sorry, but my boob really must have wanted to talk to you. Boob <laughs> <laughs> dog. So. Boob dog. I guess am I am I was I supposed to do some kind of fucking rap today or some shit? I don't know. Uh, you mean on, on air? Are you talking about like in the studio? Are you asking what my? Well, I, I'm going in the studio later on. Well, I'm sitting in the studio right now, I guess. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I mean, are you talking about what what we're going to put up on the show? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, we do. We do have. There's something or should I, should I, should we do that we should, later? We should do that later, because right now I think, let's, uh, do, let's, do take a little, let's take a little smoke break, you know, yeah. do, do that, we refresh our, our, whatever we refresh. Our bowels. Okay. Oh, you do it. Oh, you set yourself up I do, bowels. I do. Fuck. Uh, okay, let's refresh our bowels. Vowels. Oh, vowels. Vowels. Oh, I thought you said vowels. Vowels. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I think I got to rap about that. I thought you said vowels. I, I think I got to rap about that. What the fuck does refresh our vowels mean? 
here. Refresh the barrel. Oh. That's a wrap? Nah. I don't even feel like it right now. <laughs> I'm not losing. I don't even think it's playing. What's that? It's not going through here. What? Because it's needed and dangerous. See, that's why I should be. Oh! Yes. Wow. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to know. <laughs> oh, shit. I took over and I needed to say that. Hold on. What? Oh. Alright, guys. No, go ahead. I, I kind of lost uh -huh. train of what you I'm just thinking about here. You, you lost train? Ah, uh, lots of trains somewhere in my brain. Every single day I'm going insane with the middle finger up, filling up my cup. Yes, it's me, Tommy T, just bringing it up. Oh. Yep, there you go. That was his freestyle, everybody. It's going to be released tomorrow, right? No. I'm just kidding. What? Oh, did you want to freestyle? No. I said I'm gonna I'm gonna take a break and oh, wait, wait, wait. let's see. I got one. Okay. Yeah, every single time I'm in the fast lane, I might as well be living like Max Payne. Tommy T is just me with me shell, you know we bring the scene. Yeah, I be smoking the green, I be smoking the J every single day, you know I be living the way. Fuck me in my rage. Middle finger up to the president's face. Ooh, very nice. Time to go. Gotta go ahead and refresh my flows. Refresh the flow. That's all I can get on my toes and then it's time. It's time to stop because I gotta go take care of my hoes. Oh. Peace out. <laughs> and Wow, you need Redlin, dude. You need Redlin. Ah, you better. I need coffee to catch up. All right, bye, everyone. We will be back soon. Have a safe and happy, blessed day. Just kidding. Party it up. Be nice to each other. Have fun.